What's up, what is good guys, guys, and everybody else? Welcome back to the channel, welcome back to House of Cage, your boy Fula, and we're back with another Villain Tag Reaction. We are on episode 11. Um, last episode, we basically found out that Tokyo had wiped out all 4,000 soldiers that were remaining. Well, most of them anyways, you know. Um, wait, was it most of them, or was uh, the the one who who was um, trying to chase down the main army, was he the only survivor? And I think there was like a couple of them remaining. Yeah, there was a couple of them remaining and uh, yeah. So they sent one of the, the the messengers to go to the main army which had left to go up north um, to go back home, right? Um, so that they can get like help because it turned out that Canute got captured. So it was like, damn. <laughs> It was kind of disappointing to see him not do anything because he was just out there like praying, you know, whilst his people were getting uh, attacked and was like, damn, bro. Can't do nothing, Meiji? Like, damn, alright. So, yeah, that was disappointing. Um, Escalade ended up like chopping off this dude's head um, and ordering the, the his people to basically kill the horse he came on and bury both of these bodies so that nobody else can know that he made it this far. Um, his plan is to uh, actually go and attack um, Tokyo's army, which is going, which is chasing after the main army and is going to surprise them, right? So Askeladd's plan is to um, go after Tokyo, um, defeat him, and basically speaking, rescue uh, the prince. Can you? Um, and then, you know, whoever he can, um, I guess, sell him off to, <laughs> you know, whoever offers the, the best price for him, um, you know, that's good enough for him. Or, if he ends up delivering him back to the king of um, Denmark, then that means now, you know, they would, have ha they would be owed, like, a huge favor because they just, they just saved the, the, the future uh, ruler of the, of the country. You know, so yeah, that's his that's his plan right now. Um, we also did uh, see that Thor Thorfinn was having like you know, I guess internal issues kind of where he was having a dream of, with his dad. You know, telling him like, hey, you know what, uh, your your sister and mother waiting for you. Uh, forget all this revenge thing. Do you think that would make me happy? What not? Uh, but you know. I think he's still on the revenge quest right now. So we'll get to see where that goes. But yeah, anyways, without further ado, let's get into this. I hope you enjoyed this reaction. If you do, please leave a like, sub to the channel, and leave a comment down below telling me what your thoughts were on this episode. And yeah, let's go. <laughs> this is all here just relaxing on the. Wow, bro. <laughs> I mean, I guess he's the leader, bro. Yes, Everything tastes good in autumn. Hahaha. <laughs> イングランドのビールにもなれてきたよね。これはビールにはチーズだな。チェダーブラマ流れたんだ。食い物よりうまだよ。こっちの女は品があって、俺好みだぜ。わかる。恥じらいっちゅうの。ありゃキリスト教
I mean, what can you do, bro? You prisoner. Right now, he's just a prisoner, bro. <laughs> oh my God, like, but my kid's ignoring me, bro. What you expect me to do? <laughs> he does. <laughs> Is this a fool? <laughs> キリスト教に被れて久しいあんた方はもう忘れちまったかねえ。我らノルマン戦士の困るってやつをよ。バルハラ。バルハラか。いや。そうさ。バルキリーたちは常に勇者の魂を求めている。神々の戦士、インヘ
Oh, these, okay. <laughs> no shit. No. You forgot what it means to be a Viking, bro. That's how you could not see this one coming. <laughs> They're burning down the the forest. That's a lot of smoke. God damn. Yeah. yeah, that's a pretty fucked up way to go. <laughs> painful and boring? I don't think it's boring, bro. It's definitely not boring and it's definitely painful. <laughs> よし、バカでたとしても、どうせ手柄をなくなる体が持ってっちまうぜ。この作業で<笑> Truth. Truth. Sure, bro. I deny it all you want, but you know it's the truth. Am I just still holding the booze? So trap. You're done. No shit. No shit, bro. <laughs> Dumbasses. Yeah. You really are, bro. My G is on some. Oh, damn! Right in the throat, but God! Never get to choose what, bro. Yo, this dude had to show up, bro. <laughs> He's like, damn. I could have taken all these motherfuckers out, but this nigga right here. But this dude right here. <laughs> damn, bro. Nadio 
、うん、もう一つお前は自分のことをトールズのこと名乗ったな、うん、父の名はトールズ母の名はヘルガ<笑>違うかなんで知ってるああ<笑>そうかそうかやっぱりお前ヨーロッパのトールズだったか<笑>なるほど強いわけだヨーロのトロルトールズ殿のこと<笑>似てねえな<笑>父上を知ってるのか知ってるの何も Who doesn't? 世界でただ一人の俺より強い男<笑><笑> Oh, oh wait, I remember him from the first episode, right? He was in the first episode, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> Yo, that's fucked up. <laughs> All right. All right, bro. <laughs> Yo, I like where this is going. I like where this is going, bro. Now they're collecting the arrows. That's, that's nice. That's a nice little detail to put in there. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, what were you saying now, bro? Man, shut the fuck up, man. I don't like this dude, bro. Your men were all. Right? <laughs> man, the, the priest in the background. <laughs> <laughs> it's a princess? I, I don't understand what the heck that was. What was that? Okay. Yeah, that was another great episode, honestly speaking. Yo, I really, really do enjoy like the direction this is going. The whole、uh, Thorkel and Thorfinn thing. I really want to see how this will end. Does he have like some stories to tell? I, I kind of I k i n d of want to know like you know the past or、uh, Thor's、um, past, you know? Like what this guy s think of him, like this Thorkel dude. Like, did, did they like adventure together? Not adventure together. Did they. <laughs> too much isekais. Um. <laughs> Did they,、uh, you know, fight together? Because I think, if I am not mistaken, I think I saw him in the,、um, the first episode. I think he was on one of the boats. But I might be mistaken on that one because it's been a minute and I don't remember exactly.、Um, but yeah. So, pretty curious to see why he knows、uh, the mom and all that, right? Yo, it would be insane if they were related. Insane. What if Tokyo turned out to be like the mom's brother or something, bro? Damn, that would be crazy. But yeah, <sighs> anyways, so this is like, you know, Thor's was the only man who was stronger than me. So, yeah, that's something. 
that's something. Right now, I don't think Tovin is uh, good enough yet to kill him. I don't think so. I don't think he's good enough to defeat him. Um, it would be very difficult for him here. He did take two fingers. So, but this dude's still nasty though. This dude was still nasty holding like two um, axes, you know, and yet he's missing two fingers. Like how, bro? Damn. <sighs> Respect. Respect. Um, so, at least now, you know, uh, this dude is safe, I guess. Kinda. <laughs> I mean that reveal. I'm not sure what that reveal was. I don't know why they were all so surprised. Is it because he just looks too pretty? I don't know. Um, but yeah, for for a minute they all think dude's a girl, but you know he's not. He's probably he's probably like just really really pretty. That's it. Um, so yeah, that's. The <laughs> but I really don't like this whole Ragnar dude. This Ragnar dude. Nah, I don't know, bro. And then you know. He had the bows, he had the bows to go like, oh, because of your reckless actions, my men got slaughtered, scattered and slaughtered. Like, come on, bro. Your men were all gonna die anyways. They were already dying, fam. They were, your men were dumbasses. You and your men were dumbasses. Man, like, I don't know, bro. I don't know. But it's not gonna end well for him. And I won't even be like, you know sad about it i'll actually probably be happy when this dude is done because i don't know i feel like he's the one who's been making this dude this this way who's been making this um can you do to be the way he is man that pri that priest was all they just getting hammered bro <laughs> they're like yo oh who do you think which god is better is like oh whoever made the booze bro <laughs> Oh my, here's the definition of blame it on the alcohol, bro. Like, damn. That's some sad stuff right there, bro. That's some sad stuff right there. Uh, but, yeah. Anyways, I really did enjoy this. This was great. Uh, I can't wait to see what comes next. Oh, there was also that scene where, like, um, Ascalette's right-hand man. I forgot his name. Um, He was like, you know, whether you, you, you like, um, denied or not, you know, you you actually do put a lot of trust in this dude and in um in Thorfinn, which is true, you know, which is true. He, he does trust him quite a lot, actually. But I mean, the dude is capable, you know. He's proven that he's capable multiple times. So yeah, definitely he should be able to trust him, or at least trust in his abilities, you know. So yeah. Um, but anyways, uh, I hope you enjoyed this reaction. If you did, please leave a like, sub to the channel, and leave a comment down below telling me what your thoughts were on this episode. And yeah, later.